What's good, yo? It's your boy, Coke Got It, coming at y'all with another video. Today, we're going to get into my 2018 predictions for West Virginia. Before we get into it, hit the like and subscribe button. It ain't going to hurt you nothing to do that. Anyways, let's go. Last year, West Virginia, <clears throat> I mean, they had a decent season like they do pretty much every year. Nothing special, nothing too bad to talk about. They ended the season with Will Greer getting hurt. I think they lost the bowl game to Utah or some shit. But this year, Will Greer comes back. He's got his receiver, Sills, and old buddy Johnson coming back with him to returning. It's looking like it's going to be a high-powered offense. They're in the Big 12, which the Big 12 don't really play too much defense, so they don't have to worry about that too much. And I believe this season could be a big year for them. They start the season off playing against Tennessee. They're definitely going to beat Tennessee. Tennessee's fucking trash. Then they go home and they play Youngstown State. They'll win that. Then they go to North Carolina State, and I definitely got them winning that. NC State don't have the defensive line they had last year. They'll probably have one nice like that again in about two, maybe three years, but they're going to have a fall off. <clears throat> so West Virginia's going to win that. Then they're playing Kansas State. Technically, you know, they could lose this game, but I got them winning against Kansas State. Then they're playing Texas Tech. Definitely got them beating Texas Tech. It's in Texas Tech. Then they come home and play Kansas. Definitely going to beat Kansas. Then they go to Iowa State. Definitely got them beating Iowa State. I don't believe Iowa State's really going to upset nobody this year. And then they're at the house against Baylor. As a cakewalk game, Baylor was trash last year. I don't see no reason why they would have a big improvement. Maybe a slight improvement, but nah, Baylor's trash. Then they go to Texas. I got West Virginia losing this game. I, you guys have seen my Texas video. I got Texas... I got high expectations for Texas this year. I do. And plus, the Big 12 to me is weak this year. Oklahoma, they're going to have a fall off. I don't care what Oklahoma fans say about no Rodney Anderson or Kyler Murray. They're not going to be what they was the past two years or whatever. It's not. They're about to have a fall off. And I believe Texas is going to take advantage of all of this. And with that door wide open, I believe Texas is about to step through it. So that way they can go ahead and get the hype and continue getting the recruits that they've been getting. Then they come home and play TCU. I got them beating TCU. TCU's probably all around consistently the best defensive team in the Big 12, but even their defense ain't all that. Their offense definitely ain't all that. I got them beating TCU. Then they go to Oklahoma State. They could definitely lose this game. They could definitely lose it. I got them winning it, though. <clears throat> I, well, no. I mean, out of Texas, TCU... Oklahoma State and Oklahoma. That's how they finish the season. They got they go to Oklahoma State at the TCU, and then they come back to the house to play Oklahoma. And I do got them beating Oklahoma. I definitely feel like they're going to beat Oklahoma. But I feel like at worst, West Virginia had go 9-3, 10-2. At best, I got them going 11-1. And, and I got them going to the Big 12 Championship, going up against Texas. And I definitely got Texas winning, but... If they go 11-1 and one and win the Big 12, they, they have a shot at the playoffs. I don't f really foresee, foresee that happening. I see Texas going, but you never know, though. But anyway, that's my predictions for West Virginia. Like and subscribe so that way you can know when my next video drops. I'm moving on to the Big 10 now. <clears throat> Probably going to be Michigan, Michigan State, Penn State, Ohio State, because anyone on the other division of the Big 10 is totally irrelevant. But I'm Coke Gotti and I'm out.